It was our goal to be not just a GPS company, but a mapping company, communication specialist. Uh, we wanted multiple markets, as I've emphasized before, in aviation, marine, and land markets. And our goal was to be selling in every country of the world with in-country repair and service. Government was not created out of a, a vision to get rich. You know, it was created out of a, a strong desire. And uh, frankly, at the time, it was almost a desperation to, to serve, to uh, put to use our technical knowledge and uh, common sense to make a greater difference. There are still frontiers to conquer, firsts to achieve, passions to inform, to discover something new, to innovate. Garmin is a company that's, that's marked by people who never limited what we could achieve. We were once perceived as, as, a, uh, as a marine company, then an aviation company, then an outdoor company, then a P&D company. Uh, uh, maybe we'll be perceived as, as an action uh, camera company or as a wellness company. Uh, but we're never just one of those things. We always add and collect so that Garmin becomes more to every user. But what we found is that Unless our products really offer a unique value, a unique utility that differentiates them from the competition, that makes them superior to anything else that's on the market, and something that, that users find compelling. I've been running for going on eight years. When our devices started to become more wearable, more watch-like, um, I can take them with me when I travel, they're my alarm clock, they're my timepiece, and uh, oh by the way, um, they're, uh, they're my companion when I, when I run. That makes it a, a, a really sticky device and something that you want to wear all the time. The beauty of Garmin is that our people are all uh, participants in every uh, market that we serve. And uh, they know what works, they know what users want, um, they talk to users. They not only have their own experiences, but they, in their communities, they get all of these perspectives from the outside, and it, it translates into a superior product. I was motivated to do a triathlon out of a sense of trying something new, and uh, just to see, uh, to see if I could push myself to that level. I think what's readily apparent in a, in a uh, competition like that is where you're weak and where you're strong. <laughs> What I got most out of that experience was, was number one, um, uh, proving to myself that I could do something that intense uh, and complete it. And then number two, uh, having the uh, camaraderie with my coworkers that were also doing it and, and uh, with my sons who, uh, who beat me badly. I've always been a person who doesn't like um, to apply the word can't or, or hard to what I'm trying to accomplish. When I'm uh, confronted with the word can't, um, it tends to motivate me more and uh, tends to try to uh, put me in a mindset of how. Garmin's core DNA will remain that we're a company that is a group of explorers looking to have a great journey. This is our age of discovery. Our time to see what's out there. Beyond a better handheld GPS or PND, 
beyond running watches, avionics, or nautical plotters. Time to ask ourselves, what if? What if what we created didn't just help you find your way home? It helped you find a better world. Let's go find it.